If you are struggling to start over your life, this is for you. According to Cambridge Dictionary, start over means to begin to do something sometimes in a different way. It is hard to start over after a divorce, after heartbreak, death, after losing your job. Everyone feel afraid to start over because they are not ready to invest their time and energy into something they have done before, like attending an interview, go for a date, start over your business. It is hard. I have been there before. Either we are afraid to start over because we are not ready to lose everything we already have, or to hustle again, or we are afraid of failures, we are afraid things will get messy again. We are afraid people will judge us. We are afraid to step out of our comfort zone. But if it's not now, then when? If you are struggling to start over your life again, I want you to ask yourself a question. Will you let your loved one be stuck somewhere when you know they are capable of doing something great? Will you let your loved one stay in a box just because they are afraid to face challenges? If you are saying yes, I might need to question you, do you really love them? Because when we love someone, we can't see our loved one suffering and struggling. We will do something to help them. But when it comes to ourselves, we remain quiet. Why? Do you really love yourself? If you're saying yes, then get ready to start over your life again. You can do it whenever you are ready. You can speed up, you can slow down, you can run because that's your journey. You don't have to rush. You don't have to compete with anyone. It's your journey. It won't be difficult as it was before when you were a beginner, a new beginner. Because this time, you're not just a beginner, but a beginner with tools. You have knowledge and experience. This time, you have something you never had before. You know what is your strength. You know who is your people. You know your strategy. You know what you have to do, what you shouldn't do. You know how things will flow because you have been there before. Don't waste it. Please. It is hard to be a beginner at the first place, but if you can do that without any tools, why can't you do it again when you have tools, experience, knowledge? But don't be too confident, just be you. Your failures are not just meant to be your failures, but it can be your great experience and knowledge to guide you throughout your journey. People who fail the most when they use their failures as a lesson, knowledge and experience, that is the best comeback. You know how many successful people was once a great failure. Think about it. You can do it too. That's the block. Till then, I'm Kartika Seger. See you next time. Remember, the goal is to grow together even if our purpose and destination are different.